okay. more stuff in the manuscript than, than just the one. There is, there is. This uh, is we one. don't have to sell them on okay. it. You know, this is one piece. Go look for it. Yep, there you go. Yeah, cool. Okay. And uh, and big four. If, if we see big four, because that you know uh, that's that's all the rage right now. Okay. Uh, so uh, it's great. It's a great okay. trick, and I'd I, be glad I can to understand why people love it. So Thank uh, you. let's let's see it. Okay. Yeah. And then when I can do a lot quicker setup. Look at that. I'm already ready. <laughs> I'm sorry I ever brought out the orangutan. <laughs> I do need a few people to help me. Is there anybody left here who would uh, be willing to help? Rose, come on up. You want to help again, Butch? Butch is my sidekick. All right, you want to come up and help? All right, so long story short, it's a late for that. <laughs> when I was in Vegas playing the slot machines, I noticed that there is a little bit of a gap or a hole in Vegas in the games they provide. As many of you may know, there are a million different poker games. There's poker games you can play with eight cards, seven cards, six cards, five cards, three cards. Jay Marshall's favorite game was Let It Ride, which is a variation of poker. But what I found out is there weren't a lot of uh, four-card poker games. So I figured if I could devise a four-card poker game and sell it to the casinos, I could be a billionaire. So I devised Big Four Poker. It's a simple game to play, like all your best uh, games are. It's only four players. Each player gets four cards and only four cards. Uh, best hand with those four cards wins. And the most important rule is the fourth rule. The house makes all the rules. <laughs> so uh, we've got um, four hands with four cards, which makes how many cards? Um, six, thank you very much, 16 cards. If you would take the deck, and if you would please count 16 cards down onto the table. So already you probably notice this is a little different than other uh, poker games because most casinos don't even let the uh, players handle the cards in the deck. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. We'll use you as a dealer. So if you would uh, gather those cards up, I'm going to have you be the dealer. We're going to mix them up, but in a moment, not right now, in a moment, okay. what I'm going to ask you to do is take and deal however many cards you want to down on the table. You stop whenever you want in your packet of cards. You turn over the remaining cards in your hand. You drop them on top. You pick everything up and you give it a cut. You got it? I think so. Okay, so deal however many cards you want to one at a time onto the table. Stop whenever you'd like. Turn the cards in your left hand over, face up, drop them on top, pick everything up, give it a cut. And you can do it again. Go ahead. Say, uh, yeah, sure, cut. What the heck? It's your life. Okay, if you want to <laughs> deal some more, <laughs> one at a time on the table, you want to do the dealing thing again or not? Sure, it's up to you. Okay, good. We've got, what, three, four hours left in? Yep. Okay, good. <laughs> Whenever you want to stop, turn them over, Yep, place them on top. You want to give it a cut or not? It's up to you. It it's your life. Okay, good. You can flip it over and do it from the other side. You want to do it from the other side? No, I'm fine with it. You're fine? Mm -hmm. You want to do it again? Uh, no. I you want to cut them again? I think it's enough. Should he cut them again? Yeah. Cut, cut them again. again. <laughs> Just for Rosie, cut them again. Okay. You want to cut them again or you're happy? Uh, it's up to you guys. <laughs> I'm happy now. Okay, good. Because yeah. I want to go home at some point, too. Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> All right. So if you'd spread them between your hands, you can show everybody, too, that the cards are some face up, some face down, and a mishmash, hash budget cards. Square them up. Now I'm going to have you deal out the four hands, okay? The house obviously always gets the first hand. So you deal one card to me and then deal the other cards out, if you would, okay. please. So start with me. Oops. Let me get the sign out of the way here. That's my fault. I'm trying to go for production value here, and I'm just making a mess. All right. And since you're the So again, this is obviously a lot different than other casino games, because where have you ever been at a casino where they let this, the uh, people playing the game shuffle the cards, handle the cards, deal the cards? I haven't touched the cards since we started. All right, so you can take a look at what the cards are on the table. And at this point, since you were the dealer, Butch, I'm going to give you the opportunity to switch your hand for any one of these hands if you'd like. But look closely at some of the yeah. hands. You can stay with yours, too. It's you up to you. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of interested in that hand right there. You want it? It's yours. Okay. Just okay, switch. switch them like that. You sure? I'm positive. All I right. know I'm going to lose anyway. Yeah. All right. All right, so we'll take a look at the hands. Since they're already face up, so we see that yeah. your hand, sir, your name is? Trent. Trent is uh, two pair, tens, and a four. So that's not a bad okay. hand. That's a bad hand. Rosie, we'll see what you've got since your cards are face up too. Yes. Uh, we've got, ooh, three of a kind, three jacks. That's pretty good. Yeah. That actually beats that. But I think you were the smart one, Butch. Because <laughs> you took the ace, the ace, the ace, and what do you think? You can only hope. Can only hope. Look Ooh. at that, the ace. Ooh. 
I think you might have made a smart move. <laughs> we'll take a look at my hand and see what I've got now, though. I've got the six of hearts, the five of spades, the three of diamonds. You don't think. Do you think? You don't think. Yes! Yes, I can't believe it, the eight of clubs. Yes, this never happens. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, oh, I think you missed something. There's one more rule on the card. Can you by any chance read that? House makes all the rules. No, underneath that there's fine print. Uh, well, fine print. If I could read it that, says I fine print. It says fine print. There's one more rule. With a little arrow pointing to the back. And you know what that last rule is? The five of spades, the three of diamonds, the six of hearts, and the eight of clubs always wins. Wow. And that's big four poker. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, my dear. That's big four poker. There you go. Very, very nice. And if they're interested in that, available also from uh, Penguin. Yes, it is. Uh, and uh, com comes with the, with the sign and also a, a little pocket size so you can do it walk around. It does. Your wallet. And it yeah. comes with a walk around size yep. card. And it's got the rank of hands in the back, and it comes with a magnifying glass, which I forgot to put in my pocket. So in case, <laughs> yes, in case you can't read the, the fine print. Yeah. Is that it, Tom? That's it for, for me. For fantastic. Let's have another big round of applause for Tom Dobrowolski. Come on over here and, uh, and have a seat. This All is right. the uh, relaxing part. Thank you. We'll just 